Hello. Today I'd like to walk you through measuring the lift height on Neuendorfer's EMR impact wrapper. We'll be working with a 10 pound 120 volt wrapper. However, the process is the same for the 10 pound 240 volt, the 20 pound 120 and 240 volt wrappers. Your wrapper's identification label will indicate which wrapper you are working with. First, we're going to need a few tools. A wrench to remove the top plug, a tape measure to measure the lift height, and a non-metallic rod. In this case, it's a quarter inch diameter to fit through the 9 16 diameter hole. This rod is pre-marked for the 10 pound wrapper and I'll discuss how to do this momentarily. We're going to start with removing the top plug. And now we'll take our rod and insert it through the hole and let it bottom out on top of the piston. We have to zero out this rod. To do this, we'll make a mark at the top of the wrapper. In this case, it's the first red indication line. From there, we will measure one inch increments down the rod, and this will determine our lift height when the wrapper wraps. We're going to take our pre-marked rod and insert it into the hole. The piston, when, when the wrapper is energized, the piston will lift causing the rod to come up. The intention is to grab the rod at the peak of the piston. I recommend completing this process two times to ensure you're at the peak. Hold the rod steady and catch it at its peak. The second hit should gently touch the bottom of the rod. My fingers indicate how high it lifted. In this case, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven inches of lift height. If this is not your desired lift height set point, you can increase the wrapper half cycles or decrease the wrapper on time half cycles in your wrapper controller. By increasing the half cycles, you will increase the lift height and by decreasing the half cycles, you will decrease the lift height. Upon completion, it's important to secure the top plug to ensure that no water penetrates into the wrapper housing. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us or visit our website at www.newendorfer.com.